Hi, welcome back to GP Reactions. I uh, hope you're enjoying your weekend and having a lovely Sunday afternoon. Um, gonna be listening to a little bit more Nightwish now, and I'm kind of a little bit nervous about this track because I've heard it mentioned a few times. So I'm assuming that this is one of their one of the favourite tracks for Nightwish fans to uh, listen to, and indeed it is called Everdream, and it was from their I believe it was from their 2002 album, The Century Tri Child. Um, so yeah, without further ado, this is the live version, of course, from uh, Wac Wacken, and uh, that's 2013. I'm probably going to be sort of correcting on my pronunciation again, but um, there's only kind of so many ways I can say the name of this um, location. Um, so yeah, without further ado, this is Nightwish. Ever dream live. Oh, maybe this is going to be a slow one. Oh, it's building up. Never felt away with me. Just once that all I need. And finding, finding you one day Ever felt a way without me My love, it lies so deep Have a dream of me There's a lovely contrast so far. Um, I love the way this song started. Um, it kind of felt very gentle, like a ballad almost. Um, but it kind of gave it a little bit away that the, the audience started clapping, um, bringing up the tempo sort of thing. And um, again, you know, both both uh, both singers, Fleur and um, Mar Marco, um, they're, they're, um, his voice is actually lovely, lovely to listen to on, on this um and I think he kind of he's very good at changing his voice uh, to suit the mood of the lyrics as well. And I noticed that between this just now, which I thought was beautiful, and the previous track. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm really enjoying this. Um, I, I'd love to know what 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 it is when somebody's being carried around in the audience as well. Not to be too flippant, but uh, I, uh, what what is that called? Uh, Yeah. 
that was her Nightwish uh, with Everdream, and um, it's. I can see why. Um, I can see why this this song is kind of held so kind of dear to Nightwish fans. Uh, it's kind of got every aspect of a song that you kind of want. It's got the emotion. Uh, it's got the the building in temper. Uh, it's got some fantastic guitar bits um, throughout the song, and um, right at the end, it was just it was. It just went into a whole different. It was like it was in full throttle at right at the end. The drums, the vocals were just absolutely unbelievable. Um, she she her voice when when just when you think that her voice is is really good, she then kind of like takes it to a next level, and uh, she's got so much like kind of power in her voice. Um, so, so every aspect of his song I loved. I loved the contrast between. Uh, the the vocals uh, of of Marco um, in this track compared to the last track I heard, um, and he has such a powerful range as well. When you've got two really really good singers in the band, um, and especially about their their male and female, uh, it kind of opens up a, a world of possibility. I'm guessing to to kind of really um, have a, um, have a variety of of tracks. And that they can excel at um, and take it in turns. So uh, yeah, you know it's a fantastic, fantastic song. Um, so I wasn't I wasn't sure about the lyrics. Um, I mean the title says "Ever Dream," and I kind of got the impression uh, early on that it may have been uh, uh, somebody's kind of wake uh, what not like a, a daydream. Um, but then um, then and kind of later on I picked up something else of that that maybe it was a dream. So. I'm gonna have a quick look at the lyrics and see if they kind of make any sense. And I know I've sort of been t told about this before that uh, the lyrics kind of tend to kind of veer between being something very tangible to sort to quite abstract. And uh, I'm kind of happy to kind of delve in and see if I can uh, draw out my my interpretation. Um, so yeah, it ever felt a way with me just once that all I need. Uh, entwined in finding you one day ever felt a way without me my love it lies so deep ever dream of me um, so yeah I mean it does seem like this is a song about 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 love and um, possibly longing for love as well um, would you do it with me heal the scars and change the stars would you do it for me turn loose to heaven within you know it's kind of like it's almost wishing that a particular person or maybe just a, a, an imaginary person that they have ability to turn your life around and we'll be uh, i'm assuming like the stars uh, are how we navigate um in the old in old times um they navigate by the stars so and the stars are also something that kind of um we kind of reach read our horoscopes from i guess um so yeah, it's, it's all about kind of predicting the future and how the future will sh can be shaped through your um, potential love of someone. And um, so it, it, it feels like it's gone from the dream, which is the dream to um, to be with someone, um, to the actual, you're kind of fantasizing about how somebody could change your life. I take you away. Uh, cast away on a lonely day, a bosom for a teary cheek. Uh, my song can but borrow your grace, ever felt away. Um, this feels like a, a, a genuine dream sequence. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it's a, a dream sequence because it feels very abstract. And often when we have dreams, um, it doesn't make any sense at all. Uh, you can have a really tangible dream and then it's kind of followed by you may be eating ice cream. And it's just just random sometimes, and this does feel very poetically random. So, um, come out, uh, come out wherever you are. So lost in your sea, give in, give in for my touch, for my taste, for my lust. Ever felt away. So kind of, but again, we're back to that kind of waking fantasy, um, that daydream about um, a person or um, a person in your imagination that you would. You know, you kind of long for, and 
um, you, you're kind of losing yourself in their world, but um, they might not be aware of your desire. So, you know, you want to put your desire out there on the plate in your mind that that's how things would kind of um, um, progress. Um, your beauty cascaded on me in this white night fantasy ever felt away. Again, you know, we automatically, our mind automatically creates these um, fantastic scenarios and um, they kind of very rarely sort of play out that way but, um, and sometimes fantastic scenarios play out that way when we haven't thought about them. Um, and, and clearly the, the white night, um, even though it, it means dark, um, it could be a, that the, the, the person feels that they are a white knight uh, in waiting um, to kind of whisk their fair maiden away. Um, yeah, it's, it's, a, I, it's a lovely song of brilliant, a brilliant live performance. I do actually really like the lyrics because uh, they work on every different level of the theme of, of dreaming, I think. And um, yeah, as I said, uh, as I said at the beginning of this, um, I can I can see why this is like um, a really kind of popular uh, song for Nightwish fans, and um, it's definitely one I, I I'll kind of remember and add that to uh, my um, playlist when I'm on sitting on a bus going to work, because uh, that's usually when I'm dreaming as well, um, and sometimes literally. Uh, so anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. I really enjoyed this. It's like next, uh, this live version and um, I'm kind of moving on to the next one. Again, I haven't got a clue what it is until I read it um, to see what the track is. And so yeah, you know, take care of yourselves. Uh, subscribe if you, if you like. Um, if not, just join me in the comments below. And uh, as always, um, I, I'm loving these re reactions that I have the privilege of doing to this great group. And um, Till next time, take care of yourselves.